Almost all my content on this channel is biblical in nature, with some cycling and maybe arts thrown in for good measure. Some of you noticed I didn't post a video last week, so this video is sort of a blog, an update, an apology, and plans for the next few months all thrown together. You're watching the Caffeinated Bible. My name is David Parrish, and this week we're not doing anything theological, we're just doing an update. So if you like this channel, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe, that will really help me out a great deal, and let other people know about it. Thanks. Let me lay out the three things I want to cover in this video. First, why I didn't post a video last week. Second, an update on my heart and health. And third, video plans for the next few months. The first excuse is why I didn't post a video last week. You can blame my obsession for cycling for why I didn't get my video out last week. This is my fifth year in a row to ride the Cocopelli Trail from Grand Junction, Colorado to Moab, Utah. 150 miles of off the grid, throwing your body and bike at rocks, mountain biking over three days. It's an incredible trail, amazing scenery with about 100 other great people. This explains why I'm repairing and giving my bike some love right now. Now I was planning on filming this video outside. I need to show you what's going on out there so that you understand why I didn't do a video outside today. I was planning on shooting this video outside riding my bike up to one of the great overlooks that we have around Colorado Springs, but we're in the middle of a really high windstorm, and the high wind here really creates horrible audio. In fact, I'm a little nervous about being this far away from my tripod. I had really hoped to get that really dramatic sort of cinematic look for the video. Not this time. We're gonna have to go back inside to the garage and continue our video. Second, I had intended to do a video on riding the Cocopelli Trail again. However, I have two videos up from about three or four years ago, and I'll have a link to them over here and down below if you're interested and you want to check them out. But after carrying the video camera, microphone, batteries, a few clamps, and a tripod for half the day, I had enough. This stuff is heavy when you're biking and it's cumbersome, even with small GoPro type cameras. I have a few clips to show you, but that's all there is. As you can see, I'm not in Colorado Springs anymore. We are in Grand Junction, heading ready for the Cocopelli bike ride. Kodak moment. Crafting the Colorado way down there. The tough thing is, is that I was hoping for some really good news from the cardiologist when I went in to see him. Hey, how about that? Your heart is doing great. It's doing much better than expected. You don't need to see me for another year. Nope. What I found out is that it's gonna get progressively worse and now I have to take anticoagulants because I have a higher risk for blood clots and strokes. Double sigh. And I'm looking at probably two procedures this year to be done on my heart to try and stabilize its rhythm. All this is to say that it was a rather discouraging appointment with the cardiologist from that perspective. But I did get permission to go on the ride, which I really needed. I know how fortunate I am, especially when I consider all the people alive today or in human history to get the care that I do. But then in a hundred years, I'm sure they're going to look back on what they're doing to my heart and consider these doctors butchers. We'll just have to leave it till then. This brings me back to the plans for my channel. 
I'm trying to decide which videos I should focus on for the summer and for the upcoming months. This is the third year in the lectionary's three-year cycle, or year C. The gospel readings for this year are primarily taken from Luke, with a few from John thrown in for good measure. If you aren't sure what a lectionary is or how they work, I have a whole video on that that I'll have a link up here you can click on or once again underneath the video. So expect most of my videos to be from the Gospel of Luke for the next few months. I know, everyone has their favorite Gospel and would love for me to walk through that one instead, Matthew, Mark, or John, but we're going to stick with the lectionary schedule and look at Luke's Gospel. I'm also hoping to throw in some videos on how various biblical texts have been interpreted through the long and rich history of church tradition. The meaning of a text far outlives what its original authors intended, often in surprising and amazing ways. And we stand in the middle of that deep river of interpretation, or what we would call tradition. In the fall, I'll be teaching a course on an introduction or a survey of the New Testament for Fuller Theological Seminary. So starting in September, I hope to combine these videos with the content for that course. Sort of bringing you a seminary course light via YouTube. Well, the bike took quite a beating and it needs a little bit more work. But I wanted to give you an update on the channel about where I was out, my health, plans for the summer, various things like this. Next week, stay tuned, we're going to return with another video that's going to focus on biblical text. Until then, peace. Thank you.